What's up and welcome to another episode of Beyond the Pavement, the show dedicated to exploring the beauty of outdoors and hopefully inspiring you to adventure out yourself. I'm with Bradley today. What's up, Bradley? What's up? Bradley's been on another episode up in the, uh, it was like Asheville or Boone area, um, up in the North Carolina mountains. You should check it out. I'll put a link up, up there or there or down below. You'll find it. I'll put a link up somewhere. Um, but today we're going to do a little kayaking. Bradley's got a couple of kayaks. Thank you, Bradley. No problem, Kyle. And uh, he's like, hey man, let's go kayaking. So I was like, yeah. I was like, let's, let's do that. Because today is a beautiful day. Uh, summer's just winding down and it's getting a little cooler outside. It's maybe 78 degrees today or something like that. Ish. Yeah, it's beautiful. Um, so we are at the Weatherington Landing. Ba boom and uh what we're going to do is drop off my car here and then we're going to go to another spot with his trucks and the kayaks and put in the kayaks there and then ride the kayaks down here and then somebody has to stay with the kayaks while i take the car go get the truck bring the truck back down here and then take the truck back to the car and uh that's what we got to do today but uh it's 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 gonna be worth it, right? Yes, it'll be worth it. A lot yeah. of driving, but it'll be worth it. A lot of driving, but we're gonna be on the river today. It's a beautiful day, it's not too hot. Um, we got a little bit of bug, bug spray on us. We got some sunscreen on us. We're ready for this. I'm gonna wear a hat and maybe switch um, my shirt up a little bit to get some sun protection. Um, but yeah. And while we got you here, make sure you like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell, ding, ding. Make sure you can find us on uh, Get Out There BTP at Instagram and Twitter. All right, you ready? I'm ready, you ready? All right, yeah, yeah. So we're gonna drop my car off and now we're gonna go to the other boat landing and we'll uh, see you there in... <laughs> All right, so uh, hopefully that worked. I feel like it worked. We're here. We're at the other boat landing. I'll put directions to where we are putting in the kayaks and I'll put directions to where we're taking out the kayaks down below. All right, so we're about to hop in these kayaks, jump on the Noose River. Today, it's going to take close to an hour and a half, maybe a little less, because the river's moving pretty swiftly today. Don't forget your life jackets. You need to put your life jackets on before you get in, right? It's going to be good kayakers. Bush, stop, Bush! But put on your life jacket. Make sure you got life jackets. And uh, be safe. Oh! Oh yeah, oh, I'm off. I really hope I don't flip this sucker. It'll be a bad day. Watch out for boats. That's how you be safe. And then don't tip over in their wake. The river is higher than normal, so there's a lot of fallen trees on the edges and they're covered up right now. So you want to stay in the center, try to avoid those trees because they will be right under the surface. All right, so we've uh, been, you know, just taking it easy. We had a little pit stop, drink some water, make sure you bring water, stay hydrated. Um, but it's been a nice day, like so nice. There's some clouds coming in. It may have a little shower. Like you never really know in North Carolina. But the breeze out here feels amazing. And uh, it's definitely worth the time if you, you know, got some kayaks. Um, hit the spot up. Sweet. What do you think, Bradley? got you here make sure you subscribe like hit that notification bell ding ding Whoa! all right so here's an update for you um, we're still floating down the river 
it's pretty much the same stuff but all the same stuff is just beautiful uh, it's just really nice day I just can't get over how nice of a day it is today it's wonderful um, but if you have the chance come out here and do some kayaking on the Noose River but it's earth this too <laughs> and there's nothing I can do Alright, so we made a little stop at the nature center to check out these birds here. Just pulled up our canoes and uh, stopped in. And I don't know, what, there's a buzzard right here for sure. I don't know what that is. I think it's a falcon or a hawk. And but an it's really cool. Yeah. And an owl. Yeah, definitely an owl. Just checking us out. And since we're here, that means that we're not too far away from where we're going to uh, get my car drive back to get the truck to pick up the kayaks um, so enjoy the rest of the trip it's been a beautiful one so far hit that like button hit that subscribe button enjoy all right let's go <laughs> it looks like you're doing a bad trick i am too yeah i'm about to get the spin thing standing right there right <laughs> that is pearson park it was dedicated to a sheriff deputy that was killed in the line of duty, uh, Alan Pearson. Uh, they do sand in the streets. They have live bands on the stage back that way. Yes, to check out Pearson Park. Right up to the. Watch it, man. Watch the page off. <laughs> definitely make a day out of it like we did I'd say it's probably hour and a half trip if you weren't to stop we stopped a couple times checked the nature center out might have been about three hours for us so definitely recommend it and get out there beyond the pavement, pavement. Ha -ha!